The dawning of the Chris Kleiman era in Manhattan. Mark Hunter TV, the voice of college football with Kansas State's schedule ranking and a record projection next. Talking Wildcats, the Kansas State variety here at Mark Rogers TV, the voice of college football. We are ranking the schedules in the Power Five from 70 all the way up to number one. That's all the Power Five conferences plus the major independents. We arrive at schedule number 33. Before we dig into K-State in 2019, would like to remind you that you can help us build the channel and continue to deliver the best in college football debate, discussion, and analysis by grabbing the Amazon link in the description section you find below. Just grab the link. It doesn't cost you an extra penny, and you don't have to buy the product. Also on Patreon, Mark Rogers TV's Voice of College Football Community. You can be a part. We want you to be a part. Here's the open invitation to our two exclusive live streams each and every week, one in which we bring you on. Yes, you can discuss college football directly with me, and also our other exclusive live stream each and every week where I respond to your viewer comments. All right, Kansas State with the 33rd ranked schedule in the country, number three in the Big 12. All right, the Big 12 schedules are easy to rank within the conference, of course, because everyone plays everyone. Kansas State is coming off uh, a missed bowl appearance in uh, – Bill Snyder's final season in Manhattan, despite his legendary status and his tremendous run at Kansas State, which is arguably one of the best in college football history. And uh, here we go with the post-Bill Snyder era and if Kansas State can be relevant once again in the Big 12. Again, they play everyone, uh, of course, in the Big 12, so every schedule is generally the same, although you've got to look at uh, which teams play five games at home, which play four on the road versus vice versa, and then you've got a number of uh, neutral site games, including the big one, Oklahoma, Texas, of course, so they play four at home, four on the road, and the one neutral game. So for Kansas State, as we look through it, they've got Oklahoma State on the road, they've got uh, Kansas and Texas on the road, they've got Texas Tech on the road, so they play the five home games and the four road games in the Big 12. Before they get to that point, it all starts August 31st against Nichols State at home, Bowling Green at home on September 7th. Those better be two wins for the Wildcats to succeed here in 2019. You would think, even though Bill Snyder had his stumbles at times against uh, the lower group of five in the FCS, uh, Mississippi State disposed of Kansas State rather easily in Manhattan in 2018, it's the return trip in the home-and-home home series as the Wildcats go to Mississippi State and Starkville September 14th against a uh, strong mid-level SEC opponent. Open date for Kansas State at a key point in the season as they group and begin conference play on the road at Stillwater on September 28th. Baylor's the next game at home October 5th, so a difficult two-game set there. Oklahoma State and Baylor back-to-back, and you can include Mississippi State in regards to opponents as three state straight games for the Wildcats. Open date October 12th, and then a difficult two-game run against TCU and Oklahoma, but both of those games are at home. The game at Kansas, which the Jayhawks uh, would expect to be a little bit better with a coaching of less miles this season, and then the brutal home stretch drive. Texas on the road, West Virginia at home, Texas Tech on the road, and then Iowa State to conclude the season. So again, Texas, West Virginia, Texas Tech, and Iowa State, a difficult closing run for K-State. So based on the difficult stretches against, uh, yeah, TCU, Oklahoma back-to-back in the final four games, based on the Mississippi State game on the road, so an SEC opponent on the road where most of the Big 12 schedules are pretty soft, Even Oklahoma only plays UCLA as it's one difficult non-conference game. This is the third most difficult schedule in the Big 12. It's number 33 in college football. We also have our spring-slash-summer projection for Kansas State football coming up here in 2019. Chris Kleiman will probably do a fine job at Kansas State. He has to face and uh, exceed all the challenges and barriers of bringing top flight players to Manhattan, and it could be a rough ride in this first series. Uh, two and seven, four and eight. Let me correct that. Kansas State, Kansas State. Yeah, four and eight and two and seven is my projection right now for Kansas State football in the Big 12 for 2019. We will have our Final prediction on Kansas State coming up later in the summer. We invite you to leave your projection on Kansas State football below. How well will Chris Kleiman do 
in the Big 12. And, of course, the record projection for 2019 right here at Mark Rogers TV, the voice of college football. We'll be back with schedule number 32 very soon.